Well, as we are dealing with the latest round of severe weather, some people in Pickaway County are still dealing with major storm damage from February. 10 TV's Lindsay Mills toured one neighborhood today, far from their return to normal as they brace for tonight's impact. Lindsay. It's been more than a month since a tornado ripped through a mobile home park in Orient, and today they are still dealing with repairs. Debris stuck in a tree, a shed flipped over, a porch awning partially collapsed, screens blown out, an AC unit torn away, some homes ripped from their foundations, and today there are empty lots where homes once stood. This is the scene at a mobile home park in Orient. At the end of February, an EF0 tornado tore through, flipping two homes on their sides. Many neighbors were home that night when the storms broke out and planned to ride out tonight's storm because they say they have nowhere else to take shelter. If you have a safe place, family, go there. Tracy Harden says she's one of the lucky ones. She didn't see much damage, but the fear from that night is still fresh in her mind. Kind of terrifying for me because I have my mother here and my mother-in-law, and I'm thinking why I'm at work. Is it, you know, did it hit our place? How much damage is there? I'm going to go home and find damage. And then when I drove through that evening, it's just devastating for everyone. Winds picked up while we went through the neighborhood. Many who didn't want to talk on camera say they wish the park had a tornado shelter. They are still dealing with the damage more than a month later and now bracing for another round. Hopefully we won't get a whole lot, but you know, where do you go when you're in a mobile home? I did speak with one neighbor today who says she's not risking it tonight with her family. They're packing up and heading out at least through dinner time in Orient. Lindsay Mills, 10 TV News.